Let's go, baby. Now, Kevin Owens, he looks pretty mad. He's just there. He's just absolutely right, right there right now. Oh, my God. I can't believe that Kevin Owens did this to Chris Jericho. I still can't believe it. Wow. Kevin Owens is really dissing Goldberg. He's like, yo, you, ne I, you never impressed me as a kid. You never impressed me now. And you know what? Um, I, I don't really agree with Kevin Owens. Like, if, if Goldberg can run through Brock Lesnar in a minute and 20 seconds, what do you think he's going to do to you? Oh. Oh, Kevin Owens been in facts. He said it's a known fact that the longer a Goldberg match goes, the, the, the more the scale tips in favor of his opponent. He just has to outlast him, Kevin Owens is saying, basically. He doesn't even have to just, just um, beat him. He just got to outlast him, and it's going to do, and everything's just going to work. Guys, Kevin Owens just said that superheroes don't exist. But then explain this. Explain this Marvel Legends Spider-Man. All right, guys, so Enzo and Kaz are going up against uh, Cesaro and Sheamus. They need a tag team name, by the way. But anyways, um, they're, they're going up against them. And the winners are going to face uh, Gallatin and Anderson at Fastlane, I believe, for the tag team championships. Um, Honestly, it's like the same old thing every week with this Cesaro and Sheamus and Enzo and Kaz trying to get into the mix with them. It's, like, so annoying, like, for real. Like, the same thing every week, whatever. Like, not that, like, it's just, uh, why are you doing the same thing over and over? Jeez, but, that's yeah, whatever. That was a, I've never seen anything like that. When Enzo went to jump for the tag on Big Cass, so it's already an uppercut, a Swiss death. That's crazy. Yes! Big Cass and Enzo win at the new number one contenders for the tag team championship at Fastlane. Let's go, baby. Um, I'm kind of rooting for Enzo and Cass to win at Fastlane, honestly. They've been there for a while, right? And, um, you know, they, they haven't gotten any tag champs in, in championships in NXT, right? So, might as well make their first one on the main roster. Let's go, baby. I'm rooting for them. I like the club and all, but, you know, they haven't ever gotten a championship, so I want them to win it. Honestly, I bet when Mick Foley was like, oh, Kevin, you got a match with Sami Zayn tonight, I bet he expected the crowd to be like, yeah! But no, literally, I heard not one sound. You know why? Because it's played out. No one cares about seeing Sami Zayn versus Kevin Owens anymore. Like, they, they totally just milked the entire best friends, better enemies thing. Like, oh my gosh, give it a rest. Guys, so you know, the club and Roman Reigns both, both feel like they have some unfinished business. So you know what? Mick Foley schedules a match for tonight. The club versus Roman Reigns are going up against each other one-on-one, -on -one, right? Well two on one because of the club you know um roman reigns doesn't really want to partner he's like you know what i can handle these two on my own but um yeah so um mick foley makes the match all right guys so this dummy um akira dezawa is going up against the man with the plan by brian kendrick this dude is crazy ah! like shut up oh my god this guy is super mental He's absolutely mental, man. Please, Brian Kendrick, just end this dude. Dang, Brian Kendrick literally murked him before the match even got a chance to start. Guys, Roman Reigns is disgusting. What is he doing? He lost the match by a DQ. He's just jumping them now. Why would he be doing this? Because he showed you. This is not even fair. He's beating them with chairs and everything. Like this is not even right. No, he's not. He's just a guy. Guys, I'm so hyped that the New Day's hosting WrestleMania. But anyways, uh, uh, why, why, why are they like the one and only handsome Rusev? Like, why did uh, Lana announce him? He just said the handsome Rusev when he has that thing on his face. New Day rocks. 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 Dude, they rocks. How did Lana get the plans? Yeah, Biggie is right. She's Russian. She, she's probably a hacker. What the heck? How did Lana get the plans? She's not. She's just spilling all the tea about the booty juice and unicorn hairs. Yeah! Yes, Xavier Woods. He's breaking the iPad. Yes. He got the plans back. Get him. Get him. Kofi Kings did it. Biggie gonna hit it. They're gonna hit it. Here we go. Here we go. Midnight hour! Midnight hour! The 
the new day picking up the win against Jinder Mahoma and Rusev. Let's go, and he got the plans back. The way that Lana threw the iPad though was cringy. That looks so fake right there. The way she was like, ah, like it was so, it was delayed. It looks so weird, like. Guys, rest in peace, George the Animal Steel. Like, I'm not gonna sit here and lie. Oh, I seen, um, I seen all his mountain. But, like, for real, like, honestly, um, yeah, like, that's, that's just, like, really sad. And, yeah, like, much respect. Like, he seemed like he, he was, like, really talented. And, like, you know, a lot of the, um, older wrestlers, they're, they're putting respect on his name. So, you know, I'll put respect on his name, too. Yo, you know Jack Gallagher, also name is right, he doesn't curse, brag, or bend the rules because Jack Gallagher is just a true gentleman, that's all he is. This is the contract signing, baby. Hopefully Jack Gallagher comes away with the win. I want him to beat Neville. I'm sorry, I'm a longtime Neville fan, even for me he was NXT, and it, he was my favorite NXT, you know, but still, like, I kind of want Jack Gallagher to win. I don't like this heel Neville. He doesn't high fly enough, and, you know, that's Neville for me. That's that's always been Neville for me, the man that gravity forgot, and if, and if um... And if he's not doing the high flying stuff, then that's not the Neville that I know. Yeah, my boy Neville is sticking around for those biscuits and tea. Who wouldn't stick around? I cannot blame Neville, all right? That was my boy. You know, everybody likes biscuits and tea. Who doesn't like them? Jack Gallery is sure enjoying them. Why can't Neville? Exactly, Jack. That's just the way that you were raised, you know? Like, it's not an act. It's not an act. This dude's a true gentleman. Get him, Jack. Get him, Jack. Jack Gallagher! He knocked him far, Dang, Yeah, he knocked him straight out of the ring with that headbutt. Jeez. Jack Gallagher took it to Neville. Let's go, baby. He could be our new Cruiserweight Champion. Come fast, Lane. Oh, with the umbrella. Yeah. Back down, Neville. Who was this little girl that Nia Jax is fighting? Like, really? They should not let her fight 12-year-olds. Like, come on. She, she, she just won. Like, she's gonna win. Michael Cole is so corny. Monday Night Raw has gone Hollywood. Like, do you really think that that sounds cool? Because it doesn't. But anyways, Bailey, it pains me to say this, but the new woman's champion, the new world woman's champion is coming out. And she's going to address Charlotte because, you know, the Queen Charlotte, she wants Bailey to relinquish her title. And I see where Charlotte is coming from. Like, Bailey just needs to give that up. Bailey, do the right thing. Give it up. Give it up. Bailey, give it to Stephanie. Give the title to Stephanie. Bailey, Bailey, give the title. Bailey, give the title back. Yes, yeah, she's gonna do it. She's gonna do it. No, she's not. Bailey. Yes, no, she's yes. Not. No, she's not. Yes, 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 yes. Bailey, do it. Bailey, give the title back. Bailey! Why would Sasha be? No! Bailey, stop! Sasha, stop! Why is she coming out? Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 come on. There's only one answer. Hell no, I'm not giving up to this. What? What? She's mental. Bailey is mental. No! 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 Yeah, our Queen Charlotte is out here. She's going to take back the title that's rightfully hers. Yes, Sasha, shut your mouth, okay? Exactly, shut your mouth, Sasha. Shut your mouth. But anyways... Oh, shoot. Charlotte's going to put Sasha just... Out, out of commission, right? But anyways, Charlotte's gonna invoke her rematch clause for Fastlane. She just did, and um, yeah, I think that Charlotte, the queen of pay-per-view, is gonna just, is just gonna win it. And she's gonna take back her title. Let's go, baby. How dare Sasha do this? How dare she defeat the queen? How dare she? 
DDP is in the Hall of Fame. Let's go, baby. By the way, um, I've actually met DDP. Like, I, I wasn't, like, I've actually had an interaction with DDP before. When I was at WrestleMania Access, right, we were crossing paths, and he was like, hey, kid. I was like, what? And then he did the, you know, the DDP thing. He did the... He did the he did the diamond. I'm, I, I I can't do it with the camera in my hand, but he was like, "Hey kid," he tapped me. Then he did the thing, and I did it back. It was awesome. So I'm so glad. About, I'm so happy about this right now. Oh, correction. They're live in the stable standard tonight, not next week. I feel like they're saying, "When you name us, go in Hollywood." I feel like they're getting paid to say that because like that's just corny. But anyways, we're having Kevin Owens versus Sami Zayn on Raw for the bazillionth time. Whatever. I don't care. I honestly don't know why this is the main event. We've seen this 3,000 times. Best friends, better enemies. We get it. Guys, Samoa Joe just attacked Sami Zayn before his match with Kevin Owens. Oh my gosh. Why? Why Samoa Joe? Now the prize fighter is just left to pick up the pieces. Sami Zayn's done. He's done. But, you know, don't, don't count Sami Zayn out. You know what they say. He's the underdog from the underground. He'd come back in a big way from this. I should have counted him out because he lost. Dang, son. Sammy lost with that pop-up power bomb. All right, guys. So, uh, they're, they're reinforcing the ring right now because Big Joe and Braun Strowman, they're freakish. They're absolute freakish. It's mental. They're, they're so large. They're so big, right? So, they're reinforcing the ring. They're making it tighter. They're making the ring stronger because these guys are huge. But anyways, um, I don't know if it's a gimmick or they were actually doing it. But anyways, uh, uh, Brock Lesnar had, uh, had an interview with Michael Cole, and it was just a bunch of nonsense about how he's going to be Goldberg. You know, the usual, the usual talking or whatever. But anyways, who do I think is going to win? I think that Braun Strowman's going to win. Who do I want to win? I want Big Show to win. I hope that Big Show wins this one. They're going to do a suplex. Oh, my gosh. Guys, this is an amazing match. Oh my gosh, I did not expect it to be this good. Much respect to both of these competitors. Jeez. Big Show knocked him out. What? Big Show knocked him out. He still kicked out. What? No way. Running power slam. Come on, Big Show. Big Show kicked out. What? Nobody's kicked out of that. Big Show staying in this. Jeez. Now. Ron Strowman beat him, but Reigns coming out. Reigns is coming out. What is he doing? Guys, great raw. I actually not. Nah, only the ending was good. It, I, I didn't think the show, the whole show, was that good. I'm being honest. But the the ending's got me really happy and excited for fasting, guys. Thumbs up this video. Leave a comment below. Tell me what you thought of Russell. Subscribe to the channel. Share this with your friends. So tomorrow, guys, no TV every time. Save the video. Come back tomorrow for my SmackDown live reaction, slash review, and stay beastly. <gasps>